Good afternoon. I'm Madison Carter here at 7 Eyewitness News. We're going to take you through the 716 in two minutes. Hundreds of people who work for the city of Buffalo are about to get a boost in their hourly pay. Now, this is also known as the living wage. The Buffalo Common Council approved the rate increase yesterday. Starting next summer, all workers will make $15.38 an hour, whether they have health insurance or not. Right now, workers who have health insurance through their company on minimum wage make 20, or excuse me, 12.04 per hour, and those without health insurance make 13.50. The new living wage law also applies to companies that have contracts for at least $50,000 with the city and at least 10 employees. Now to a new law designed to close the gender pay gap here in the state of New York. This morning, Governor Cuomo signed legislation that requires employers to offer equal pay for substantially similar work. This also forbids employers from asking people about their salary history when applying for a job. Let's check in with meteorologist Michelle McLeod for a look at your forecast. Well, Madison, the heat and humidity have come back. It is hot today. In fact, your highs are going to be in the upper 80s and a few of us reaching into the low 90s, primarily showers and thunderstorms scattered, albeit for the southern tier and Pennsylvania. Tonight, it's going to be warm and muggy as well with your overnight lows in the low 70s with scattered showers as well. Taste of Buffalo is coming up on Friday and so far so good. But everyone getting in on those showers on Thursday before Friday happens. We've got to get through the showers. Friday looking nice and dry. And your weekend for the Taste of Buffalo looking beautiful and warm as well. Enjoy the forecast.